Hello everyone, Ori here and welcome back to another FIFA 20 video and today I got a very 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 special video it's Atalanta, I mean fantastic team those guys are playing FIFA in real life man I mean amazing 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 team to watch at the moment just uh, fantastic football they're playing and I absolutely love them and um, you can make this team uh, fantastic in FIFA 2 and play that amazing football and the formation I'm going to use is going to be the 3-5-2 uh, I don't like the 3-4-1-2 uh, the uh, the uh, that uh, is uh, their default because uh, it's a bit of changed formation I just like the uh, fixed formation that uh, FIFA has and um, I mean the great players here uh, no doubt Gomez is the star you got Muriel you got Ilicic and uh, the other part of the team I mean a great all-around team uh, who's gonna help you defend a lot and uh, make those uh, quick uh, uh, counter-attacks uh, fantastic 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 team to use uh, what can I say more? It's very pacey. They they move uh, so much on the field. They defend as a whole team and they attack as a whole team. Uh, so we're gonna start in goal. Uh, Golini or Sportiello? I'm gonna prefer Golini here. You can go even with Sportiello. It's by your choice. But uh, I've placed uh, Golini in goal because he has better stats. Moving to the defense. Uh, be careful because they are a bit slow, but uh, with the right custom tactics uh, this team is gonna defend almost with five uh, at the back uh, whenever you don't have the ball uh, So uh, it's not gonna be a problem. Toloi is gonna play to the to the right side uh, Palomino is gonna be our center back and I'm gonna sub Jim Shitty out uh, to uh, place uh, uh, Simon Kjaer there because Kjaer is just better and uh, Toloi and Kjaer being a bit faster than Palomino they're gonna play uh, left and uh, right uh, uh, center backs so they uh, don't get uh, caught in pace like uh, Palomino may do so moving to the uh, midfielders Deron is gonna play. Is gonna play alongside uh, Malinowski. Um, Deron and Malinowski, uh, great all around uh, midfielders. I mean, uh, for the Atalanta level, they are just uh, fantastic. They are gonna go up and down for you. They gonna protect uh, 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 your your team. I mean, they are gonna help you a lot defensively too, and they are gonna help you uh, be the playmakers and uh, launch uh, those uh, through balls. Or those long balls that uh, that uh, your team gonna need to score the goal and uh, send the balls to the trio up front. Moving to the to the right mid, uh, Hatebur is gonna be there. Uh, no better choice uh, than him at Atalanta. Uh, he's fantastic. He will go up and down. He's gonna play as a right back and as a right winger uh, at the same time for you. Uh, fantastic, uh, fantastic player. Moving up to the left mid, uh, we got Gossens here. Uh, I mean, uh, we can use even uh, Castagne, but uh, Gossens uh, better. Uh, only Castagne has a bit more pace, but I like Gossens because he's much, much, much better as a all around uh, as a all around player for you. Uh, so. Uh, as I said, uh, this is a defense and midfield. Now we're gonna move up to the three where I'm from, uh, which is uh, very important and the best players that uh, this team has. I mean, we got Ilicic here and Papu Gomez, the absolute star of this team. If Papu is fantastic, uh, amazing, amazing player. You're gonna score a hell of a goals with him. And uh, I'm gonna sub Zapata out to play some Muriel. I'm gonna play Muriel and Papu as striker because of the amazing speed that they have. They just have to be up front, and uh, because FIFA is mostly about pace, and we need them. We need them up front. Ilicic is gonna play as a cam. Uh, I think he fits perfectly there. He doesn't quite have the pace to be a striker, but uh, he has shooting, passing, and dribbling, uh, which are fantastic stats for a cam. And uh, that's why uh, we're gonna play. Uh, we're gonna play him there. This is the starting eleven, which I think uh, makes this Atalanta team play uh, fantastic. We got Zapata. Uh, we got uh, Palacic there. Uh, Froler. Uh, we got Castan. Well, we 
which you can use as a sub and maybe Marcelo if you get a red card on the way and you need to sub in a defender uh, you can put Marcelo uh, this is the team uh, they can't really play any other formation because they don't really have a left or a right back moving up to the tactics they play press after possession loss but uh, as you know uh, if you play that uh, their players would get very tired that's why we're gonna switch the balance with width 5 and depth uh, it's going to be 6 we just want this team to be up front all over your opponent I mean you want to to make that pressure on your own I mean you want to apply it manually you want to apply it yourself moving up to the offense is going to be with five with players in the box four and offensive style is going to be balanced uh, going to corners and free kicks uh, I always leave it at two uh, I just don't want a lot of players to be uh, up front whenever you're taking uh, a corner because you can get countered. Uh, to the road, decide on your own. Pop when Dilic is gonna take care. Moving up to instruction, very, very, very important. Uh, get in behind, stay forward for both of your strikers. I mean, Muriel and uh, Papu Gomez. We want them to be up front uh, so you can make that quick counter attack. And Dilic is going to be the third link to that amazing uh, counter attack that this team plays. And we're gonna put stay forward forward in him uh, we want him to be uh, that uh, extra guy up front moving up to the midfield uh, very specific instructions cut past in lane stay back while attacking and cover center for both uh, of our uh, CMs and it's going to be come back on defense uh, for both our right and left mid and getting behind uh, because we want them to help us defensively but even offensively uh, too uh, so this is the instructions for the for the midfielders uh, I think I was uh, clear in that area moving to the uh, defense just leave them and stay back while attacking at their default do not uh, touch anything there so this is the, the starting 11 Atalanta fantastic team we're gonna have a lot of fun playing with them I'm gonna go into a game we're gonna try them out let's go so first highlight here uh, Ilicic is gonna make that beautiful love to Papu. Uh, Papu is gonna take care. Papu, Papu is amazing. Another highlight here, my opponent uh, Rashford. Uh, beautiful goal to McTominay. McTominay gonna score a goal, a fantastic goal, and uh, one one. Another highlight, Papu Gomez here. I mean, look at Papu running and look at Hatterburg. Look at where he's at. He's gonna shoot, he's gonna hit the post, and then from the rebound, he's gonna score. Another highlight here, my opponent gets a penalty. I don't know if that's a pen, but uh, it's FIFA, so we're gonna take care. Pogba is gonna score it, and 2-2. Two -two. Uh, this counter-attack starts from the goalkeeper, and look at it. Illich is to Gomez. I mean, look at how fast that counter-attack is, and uh, just 3-2 uh, for us. Uh, Gossens here to the left side. I mean, look at how many players are up from Gossens. Fake gonna make the pass to Papu and Papu gonna score a beautiful goal. Another highlight, Ilicic to Papu. Look at Papu dancing there. I mean, pure class, fantastic player. I mean, another highlight here, Papu again. Papu is not, it's not gonna stop scoring. Uh, amazing. It, it's all Division One uh, gameplay. So opponents uh, are tough, not easy to beat. Papo again, I mean look at him running and he's gonna make the pass so that Ilicic can score a goal too. You think it's over? And not yet. Papu again with a beautiful drag back to Ilicic to Papu and look at Papu, maybe exaggerating here. Papu Gomez, uh, fantastic. So this is it, 8-2, I get the win. And uh, thank you all for watching and i see you in another FIFA 20 video. Bye.